Okay, welcome. Here's what we're going to be discussing here. We're going to go ahead and update your phone to Android 2.1 from the leak that Sprint gave out for the Samsung moment. Now, also, we're going to go ahead and add a custom ROM, and then we're going to go ahead and uh, root the phone. Now, also, before we before we begin at all, go ahead and put my backup. Go to the market on your phone, put on my backup, do a backup, and when you do the backup, hit apps. Uh, when it asks you, then from there, it's going to say, do you want apps and data? Hit yes for apps and data, and then make sure that's pulled down. Okay? Now, in this Samsung folder right here, I have a list of 700 and some odd apps that are free and paid for. Okay? There's, this right here is the root. That's what's going to root your phone by Joey Krim. And we're going to go ahead and put on Moment 2.1 Live Wallpaper. That's the 2.1. You're going to need the Sprint, I'm sorry, Samsung Moment Update Tool, which is right here. And your drivers for the USB, CL14. If you, if you don't have CL14 on your phone yet, then you need to go ahead and get it and uh, use the software update tool to do it now you can double check to see if you have it by hitting menu on your phone settings about phone and it'll show you for the uh, firmware version uh, CL14 now from there this is the original DDO3 the one that was leaked by Sprint and here's the Joey Krim uh, completed ROM. Now to begin, make sure you have the software update tool provided from provided by Sprint. We're gonna go here into our program files. We're gonna find it. Uh, Samsung Electronics software upgrade models binary and when you get into binary you are actually gonna see this file CL14 in there you're going to move this file out just in case you want to go ahead and revert back to the CL14. I don't know. It's your it's your uh, prerogative. But once you move it, you're going to put this in its place, the Joey Krim release. Now, since we have that, I'm going to go ahead and close here. Now, what we're going to do, go ahead and double click on this, the software upgrade tool and what it's going to ask you to do essentially is to go ahead and um, to go ahead and flash your phone so power your phone down hit next yes all day will be lost hit next okay hit next and here we are at this screen now, right now, we're going to go ahead and get into the download mode. So please just follow those instructions that is showing you on the screen right now. You're going to hold down your volume button, hold down your camera button, and then you hold down your end button or your power button to power the phone up. Now, once you have that, and your phone is in download you'll see it big blue screen with all this stuff on it gonna connect back to your USB port hit next saying it's disconnected see here usually okay let me disconnect and reconnect here for USB Sometimes it can be a little finicky, but as you can see right here, it came up ready, COM7 connected. Hit next. And we're going to skip right past this because it really didn't do anything. We're going to keep clicking next. COM7 ready. Hit next again. And this right here is what we're looking for. Okay, now first of all, if this right here, when you, when you start it and it doesn't move for about 10 seconds, close out of this program 
restart the pro restart the program unplug your USB from your from your phone take the battery out put it back in and get back into download mode then plug your phone back up into the plug your USB back into it and try it again which we might actually end up having to do that now you will see your phone flash but this is something that uh, that does occur so okay we're still sitting at two percent okay this one's moving right now all right while that's going on let me go ahead and add a side note to this as well um, if you let's say because some one time I, I thought it, it went to 98 percent so I thought that it was done for um, so I thought I had to redo it again because it stayed on 98 percent for so long unplugged the USB from the phone I took the battery out I did the uh, try to get back in the download mode when I tried to get back in the download mode it actually did it again it it, it actually had a symbol of a computer